Hello everybody, hope you're doing well. I'm going to listen to the very last song off Victoria. It's called Back to Life. I'm low-key excited for this song. Um, I heard it's supposed to end like uh, Unleashed did with The Resistance, a little jam session. So I'm super excited about that. My fear of this song is that it's going to try to copy The Resistance too much. I hope it doesn't. I hope it's unique in its own way. But I just enjoy that skill. It's the jam session from The Resistance. So I'm excited for this one. Just from the title, I thought it was going to be on the mellower side, but I knew skill wouldn't really end on the mellow side with the last track. So let's jump into it. Woo! Man, 
Alright, if it wasn't for that ending right there, this song honestly is just not that great. Honestly, it just kind of feels like a lyrical ripoff from Comatose, a musical ripoff of I Want to Live off of Unleash. It just really wasn't that super great and creative. I don't know. It just didn't really, you know, m you know, just do it for me. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it'll take time. But honestly, I feel like there are other songs on the album that I feel like I would like better than this one. But the ending made it so worth it. Honestly, it really does. I would honestly listen to this song just for that ending. So, yeah, probably this song will easily grow on me just because I love that ending. That was great. I really like that. I really feel like more Skillet songs should just end like that. Especially, you know, Skillet is not really the type of band that always is to have the guitar solo. They have the guitar solo just to, you know, have, pay tribute to, like, the older bands and such. But I think Skillet needs more guitar solos. But really, what Skillet needs is more jam sessions. Please, please, just at the end of the song, just a few more songs. Please just have that type. It, it's incredible, okay? They obviously had that because, you know, the Resistance did super well, so they're hoping this would do super well. But honestly, this sounds like the type of song that would be, like, in the middle of an album, you know? It doesn't really have that. This is the end of the album feel, and, you know, we did it, and it just feels like it's something that could have been, like, the fifth track or something. So, uh, yeah, I'm really kind of mixed about the song because I love that ending, but most of the rest of the song is okay. I remember, like, at the beginning, I thought it was going hard, but then just, I think, soon as the verse kicked in, it just just didn't really mix well. It's cool to see how Skillet is able to implement different influences of different sorts of music, for sure. And so, definitely, this is a creative brand of rock, for sure. Maybe not the most creative, maybe not the most original, but definitely, it is their own style, for sure. And they definitely, I can hear that they've made some, you know, moves and such, but uh, just, there are times where even when you do something creative and original, it doesn't fly, and I feel like that's how I feel about the verses, just uh, the way it was sung. And lyrically, this is not fresh at all. Lyrically, I prefer Reach over Back to Life. We did! We listened to the album! Thank you guys so much for watching, have a good rest of the day, and God bless.